a few observations based on neutron Raphson method. When we wish to solve f of x equals 0, that is, when we wish to find out the root of f of x equals 0, if we have the situation that slope of f of x is very large, that is, whenever f dash of x is very large, we will have step size h will be very small and in this case, we can easily arrive at the root. Suppose we have a situation that f dash of x equals 0 in the neighborhood of the root of f of x equals 0. In this case, newton raphson method will fail and hence we have to adopt regular falsi method. Another observation is that if we choose initial approximation x0 which is the initial approximation to the root of f of x equals 0 very close to the original root alpha itself then we get the root of equation very quickly that is newton raphson method is that numerical method in which selection of initial approximation close to the root does matter. If the initial approximation is selected very close to the original root alpha, we will be easily and quickly able to find out the root of f of x equals 0, even more faster than regular falsi method. In order to find out the initial approximation, if initial approximation is not specified in the question, we will select two values for x, say x equals a and x equals b. Now you will check for absolute values of f of a and f of b, that is, you will evaluate function's value at a as well as b. Then you take the absolute values of f of a and f of b, whichever is having numerically smaller value. The corresponding x value will be taken as the initial approximation. That is, when you evaluated f of a and f of b and modulus f of a is less than modulus f of b indicates that x equals a will be the initial approximation considered. If you have the situation that absolute value of f of b is less than absolute value of f of a, then we will select x equals b as the initial approximation. 